We're continuing our run on Nightmare Mode, Invisible Ink, uh, Expert plus Iron Man, uh, but with a mod uh, written by Cyberboy2000 called Challenging Enemies, uh, which adds a bunch of enemies and makes the other enemies harder. Uh, we haven't seen very many of the new enemies yet, but this should change very soon. I'm surprised that we've seen so few of them, actually. Uh, before we go in, uh, let's give a Neural Disruptor to a Neural Disruptor 3 to Prism. Uh, we probably want to keep this one on us because we're going to go to the detention center. We'll get a new agent and they will need a weapon. Uh, we'll keep a regular Neural Disruptor for Banks because she has a penetration scanner. So all three of our agents now have a way to deal with armor. Um, Banks can deal with armor 1, Decker and Prism can deal with armor level 2. We're going to upgrade speed on Banks and go in. This is a private... We, we have a server farm which is two hours closer, but we already have all five uh, slots on Incognita filled up with pretty good programs, uh, so we aren't going to play around with that. We'll just uh, go to missions that, if it's only two hours further, then it's worth going to one that actually has a chance of improving our team, rather than just getting money. This door looks safe to open, even though we've got agents out in the open. Uh, we can probably get through here. We'll want to peek through here because there could be a camera in that corner, for example. This is probably a, a nanofab or a safe of some sort. We have an Abaka drone too. And a camera and a guard. Just a regular security guard there. We'll, we might use Wisp this turn. Could use Data Blast, would hit this con the demon on this console database. We'd also get the demon database. Please don't be uh, validate. Please don't be validate. <laughs> Siphon, that's okay. Um, we get uh, the emergency reserve next turn. We haven't controlled this drone because it's still after one firewall, uh, which is good. We don't want to have to control, control drones. Uh, we will get this console here. And probably... No, we can't reach any of the consoles. Uh, if we had enough power, we could use... Wisp on these two guards, I think it would be worth it for that. Banks is still in the room. I think we should be okay putting Decker. I need to turn around to do this. Putting Decker on this square. It's probably safe from any patrols. We've got another drone there. Drilling dart and distributed processing. So drilling dart is armor piercing. We also don't have any guns yet. We might end up getting this because it would be pretty useful, especially for the final mission. Let's rotate back again. We know that there is a drone here. We don't have a way of getting enough power to use Wisp this turn, I think. This spot should probably be safe. Let's see where the drone's going. Don't think it will see either of us. We should be able to get past it next turn. Don't think we have a good spot to put banks, so we will use her AP to spy on these two guards. We are in cover from this drone. That should be fine. I think we just have to leave banks in this room for now. We'll get the emergency power on the next turn. We can use a parasite on something. It I don't see... I don't think we want to control the drones. 
until we have a good reason to. So I'm just going to put a parasite on the sound book. We'll get a power from the refraction chamber when we hack that, and it's free, so that's a net net positive. We'll be able to wisp next turn, I think. We've got another guard up here. If we can get vision on this guard, there's a drone as well. If we're able to get vision on this guard, that would be pretty good as well. I guess we aren't going to be able to. Alternatively, we hack the drone and use the drone to get vision on the guard. So that's a, probably the, the right thing to do. We don't want to take the Paradox Demon. We can't get vision on this guard. Okay, that's fine. Doesn't look like there's anything through here other than this safe. Can steal from the drone here. Let's use Wisp. This seems relatively harmless. We can get Decker through this way. It's probably worth doing. We can pin the drone. So that must be the right play. We know that this is a siphon, so I don't need to scan it as we go past. And I think we're just leaving banks here again. So it would have been safe to have her on this spot. I guess. We could EMP both of these drones, but I don't think that's a good plan. Uh, the patrols don't seem that bad. And it's unclear if this guy is going... Yeah, you know, he's just going to this spot. We'll be able to steal from him next turn because the door will be open. He won't see... Um, anything that will stop Banks from getting out of this door, so that should be fine. I think we can leave Prism exactly where she is. Let's put a Parasite on something that's free. This safe. So we can open this door. Get to here and steal from the guard. He's got a med shell. And a pass card, but we don't need it. We'd like to be able to get to here, but it looks like these... This guard and this drone are alternately blocking the door. Maybe we take the guard out and paralyze him. That would allow us to get to the safe. But then we'd need to drag the body somewhere. We'd have eight action points. That doesn't quite get us through here, I think. We might use Prism to zap him. And then get in here, or we could just wait around and see if there's a chance to get past this spot. Let's have a look through this, this door. That's our exit. It's a camera and a safe. We should be okay to take all of this down. Can't hit anything else, that's fine. We don't want to hack this drone. Um, I 
we'll have a look in this corner. It's probably nothing. Ah, it goes a bit further in. We'll just stay in cover. Maybe. We can check with Decker to see if there's anything dangerous around here. This looks completely empty. Yeah, so it's it's fine to put banks through the door. I think that's a bit better. Might as well pin the drone for another turn. We do have quite a bit of the map down here because we can see a console. We aren't in a hurry to get this safe because we can get it uh, when we go to the exit. On the other hand, we there could be a door through here, so we do want to check that. I think we're ending our turn on this. So this guy we want to wisp uh, when we have a chance to. No hurry to do that. We'll bring Banks down, pin this drone again. None of these drones are coming through this door, it seems, which is good. Server terminal. I guess we will take a look in there. We want to use up the power so we get the emergency reserve. We're going to wisp. That gives us the drone again. I guess we should have explored a bit with Prism just in case there was anything to wisp up here. Nope. I think we've seen enough guards that we should be relatively safe to put Decker through the room. None of these guards are coming through this door. There could be a guard who comes through this door. use this to get the power from emergency reserve. I think. Um, yeah, we let, let's put Deco through the door. We've got another door down there. I think we should be okay. Uh, we've got the cloak if necessary. I think now we get the chance to open this door, yeah? So there is one turn when no one's looking at this safe. We know that this spot is okay, so I think we just leave Prism around here and wait. Uh, to get the chance to get that safe. We've stolen from one of the drones, but not the other one. So Prism will, I guess, not be able to steal from the other drone. This spot ought to be safe next turn, but we can't guarantee that it's safe the turn after, and we wouldn't be able to move. I think we're okay hiding here. We can leave the door open in case we need to. Uh, that gives us a chance to, to run onto one tile. That's potentially uh, life-saving, depending on where we're seen from, if we are seen. Uh, if you open a door while someone's on Overwatch, then they shoot you before you get a chance to go through the door.
this is our detention center. And we've got one guard facing away. Do have enough AP to get to the safe. And the console and back on the drone. Seems worth it. We probably want to bring Banks down to steal from the guard though. That's validate. Oh dear. So we'll do this last. That's a drone on this spot. It might be safe to go in, but we don't get to peek first. There could be cameras if we don't peek. So I think we just end our turn peeking. Oh, that's a guard, not a drone, but yeah, now we can't get through. I think that's fine. So we weren't able to see which agent this was. I guess it might have been worth checking before we explore elsewhere. If it's Dr. Shu, then we know that we don't need to uh, uh, take demons to get into cameras. We can't get through this door this turn. We will be able to next turn. Now we use the data blast to take this camera. And this one. Can we hit all of them? Yes. And we're not hitting anything with a demon. That's perfect. Yeah, we can't steal from the guard here. We will be able to steal from this guy next turn, but we've already stolen from him. And then the turn after, I think, Prism gets in. Let's have a look in here. Nothing worth it. Uh, we aren't able to, to peek and see the agents. I think we just end here so that we're able to get through next turn. We're safe from this camera because this console gives us cover. We have stolen from that drone. Ah, we're seen by a guard. Yeah, that's why we... That's why we opened the door. No, if we'd closed the door... Based on the way the game works, this door would have counted as cover from this direction, even though that makes no sense. Well, now we've alerted three guards, including two drones. four guards because this guy is alerted as well. He's facing away at the moment. We probably want to take him out with banks. Which we can do. Or we can paralyze him with banks. Hey, investigate. Drag him here.
Hmm. So we can't paralyze him this turn, but that's... So we, we should have dragged him out here. I hope that doesn't alert the captain. Damn it, they got away. So it's really weird that this guy sees this square. If I close this door, hey, then he actually saw that and he doesn't see this square. So because I left this door open and the, the weird way that the game works, he wouldn't have seen me if I hadn't opened this door. So that's unfortunate. On the plus side, there's a good chance that we can get into this safe soon. Could use the EMP to take out probably the drone. We might not need to. It's going to do a scan at some point, so might need to take out the drone. I shouldn't have left that door open. <laughs> I just wasn't thinking about that weird way the game works. Could use the EMP to take out the camera drone as well. At the same time, if we plant it about here, I guess it doesn't hit the drone from there. Um, well, all of the guards are interested in this spot now, so let's just open the door anyway, so they don't don't kick the door in. Uh, we don't want to hack this. It's the oh, it's a siphon, so maybe we don't mind hacking that. We have basically all of the sound books under our control except for this paradox, so it wouldn't be too bad if we controlled the drones and shot the guard. We'd have the cleanup cost, but that might just be the easiest way around this. So if we take the drones and the siphon at the same time, that gives us the emergency reserve next turn. Shoot the guard. Firewalls go up, that's fine. We are heard by one sound bug. Just this one. Yeah. I guess we could have taken that and eaten the paradox. It might not have been the worst thing. Now we get this. Let's move the drone as far away as we can. The, the drones were alerted anyway, so the, the reason for not hacking them has gone away. We haven't stolen from this guard. Just a pass card. We'll want to steal from that drone. That's the one we haven't stolen from yet. I think that's it. We can put a parasite on something for free. 
there isn't anything we want to parasite yet. Two power. Still a pass card. like nothing. Yeah, it's nothing. How many safes have we gotten into? One, two, three, four. Is that it? So there should be a fifth safe, I think. One, two, oh, there's a th the fifth one here. Three, four, five. So we have got all of the safes. So we're just going for this and then straight to the exits. So all three of these drones wake up. <sighs> we can do this. Take a file wall off each of them. Could just hack all three of them again. We'll put parasites. That should be alright. That's five power, so it's probably worth taking. This drone could come through next turn, but we've got a parasite on it, so that should be okay. We haven't got vision on which agent we're saving. This guy is clearly stationary, but there could be another guard. Incognita has detected an agent currently logged as MIA. Looks like there isn't. This they is sharp. An incredible asset if you can get them back on the team. So they scan and find nothing. Let's just move them far away. Prism was able to steal from this guard, I guess. We're gonna have to validate. <laughs> There is no one there, that's fine. We'll take the validate next turn. So that we have as many action points as possible to escape. I think that's it for this turn. We can use Wisp. 
so that we've got vision on this. Uh, we, we have the, the tag on this guard. Uh, we have the reserve next turn if we use data blast, so let's do that. So we get another security guard and we get the validate. Enforcer drone. So this is one of the new guards. Fail safe protection. Automatically reboots when all firewalls are broken. Uh, so we can put a parasite on this guy, but when we hack it, we don't control it, it just reboots. Uh, no hearing, KO immune. Local scanner. Drone investigates within a short range scanner that will lo locate targets even behind cover. This scans through walls as the other scans do. And uh, when it says short range, it does not mean short range. <laughs> Uh, so we're not going to run uh, because we don't want to alert this guard, but we can use Prism to steal. Uh, Sharp can take one of these neural disruptors, probably just the regular one. This guy's just going to stay there stationary. going to take this power because it will be useful in hacking this enforcer drone if we need to. Uh, we can sell the med gel on the way out if we need to. Um, I forgot if there was anything we wanted to get the drilling dart maybe. Could be worth pinging this guard away. There aren't any other human guards alive on the level anymore. Uh, awake on the level. We got this one knocked out so the ping obviously not useful against the regular guards. We could ping him into this room, which takes the longest for him to reach. So that keeps him out of our hair for as long as possible. We can put a parasite on something. Looks like it's there's nothing useful to do that with in the turn. That's a pretty wide range for a local scanner. Uh, we're going to hack these drones again. I think they wake up and scan on these spots, so these ones we don't need to hack. This one we will want to put a parasite on. Can we hit both of them? Apparently not. So this is known to be safe on this turn at least. We can stay out in the open because we know where the guards are going. Similarly here, these drones have just woken up so they'll scan on their own spots. Don't need to pin this guard. We won't wisp just this guard because we know where he's going. Uh, we might wisp once we've seen once we have vision on this guy. So they scan, don't detect anyone. Hey, you okay? He sees the downed guard. Hmm. This drone's gone away, that's fine. We want him to go away. This drone's coming out if we don't do anything about him, so we do. Yeah, we can't hit both of them again. That's fine. Just leave him in a corner. This corner is slightly better because it's further away from anything that he can scan. 
didn't sell the Met Gel at the and if I, I think that's fine. We're probably not getting this drilling darts. We might get it. Distributed processing, it might be worth it for sharp. The more augments we give sharp, the longer he KOs guards for. don't know where this guy is going, so let's use Wisp. He's coming out, so we want to zap him. I hope he doesn't kick the door in. He kicks the door and then Decker goes down. <laughs> if he, if he, if he doesn't kick the door in, then he'll see Prism before he sh before he comes through, and we won't take him out. Um, but actually, maybe that's all right. Yeah, I think this is a bit safer just in case he does. Um, Prism is able to get into cover on this spot, which is cover from the guard. If he's standing here. And then Decker will be able to melee him the turn afterwards. Let's take... We don't have vision on the other drone, which is quite unfortunate, but we know it's going here, so that's fine. Yep, yeah, seize prism. This square is yellow, so that's fine. I think it was safer that, that way than risking him kicking the door in. This drone we can now see. We've just used the emergency reserve. Let's close the door in his face. Damn it, they got away. We are going to buy the distributed processing. Uh, we are running out of time to get augments for sharp, and the more we get, uh, the better it is. And um, we don't want the drilling darts. Uh, we do want to zap this guard, I think. We'll just uh, get him as he comes out. Um, oh, go on to melee, and we'll move sharp up here. That should be fine. We need to know that this guy is not going anywhere. The better thing to do would just be to hack him down. And then the parasite gets him next turn. That puts another guard on the level, um, but we're getting out. That's just a regular Rebecca drone. This guy wakes up, we don't mind. Uh, I think we are getting out of here right away. So Sharp gets to the exits. We have stolen from this guy already. Decker can reach the exit without running. The end. Whew. I'm sure the agent who recovered is grateful to get out of that cell. I'm grateful to have more boots on the ground. So, yeah, th this is why we have to be careful of validate. Um, it's okay to take it if we have an exit plan, um, but we don't want to take it in the middle of the mission.